Day right now is dry. Let's cross our fingers. Hey, hey, who's ready for a party? Cleveland's Puerto Rican parade is Sunday, and people from all across Ohio are coming to town to participate. Our Stephen Hernandez found a father and son duo who can't wait to be here to show off their trucks you can't find anywhere else. Mm -hmm. So it sounds like you guys are a dynamic duo. Suena que ustedes son un duo dinámico. <laughs> gracias, <laughs> gracias. Gracias. If you're a big time truck fan, you'll for sure love these small but mighty remote control trucks made by a father and son team in Youngstown. Alberto and Abdiel Perez have been working on these creations for six years and are excited to bring them to Cleveland for this year's Puerto Rican parade on Sunday. <laughs> Alberto was a trucker in Puerto Rico before he moved to Ohio over a decade ago. His love for big rigs is what inspired him to make some of his own. I would see many different trucks on the road, and one day I decided to build something big. I love challenges. I like to do unique and different things. Eventually, his son Abdiel also joined in on his father's hobby, which has taken them all across the state to conventions and clients alike. What are the reactions that you get from people when they see these trucks? Oh my God, it's crazy. It's crazy, everywhere we go. Everywhere we go, it's crazy. We, any event we go, pictures, yeah. photos, shared on social media. And now they're ready to show off their creations with the rest of the Puerto Rican community this weekend at the parade and festival. I've always said that Puerto Ricans always have a lot of ideas, and we love to show the things we can accomplish as Latinos. The Perez family hopes that their small big rigs can add loads of fun to the parade and can inspire others to keep building. You can do anything you want to, any ideas you have. All you need is enthusiasm and to keep working on it, and you'll make it. Stephen Hernandez, 19 News. Well, the Puerto Rican parade kicks off this Sunday at 11 a.m., and if you can't make it, tune in to our sister station, Telemundo Cleveland, starting at 5 p.m. or after Olympic coverage.